Italy Nissan Medina. Arctic plunge. Temperatures taking a nosedive. The cold so dangerous, even your mail won't be delivered today. Coming up, the creative way the community is helping everyone stay warm. Where you can get free hot chocolate and the one thing many of us do when it gets cold that could be bad for our bodies. Clock sharp, and here's a live look at the current temperature right now off the back deck at the Channel Free Studios. Yeah, so two degrees and wind chills that are below zero. Temperatures will continue to plummet yeah, throughout your day. And breaking last night, the post office canceled delivery today for anyone with a zip code that starts with 441 or 458, which is most of Northeast Ohio. Yeah, Those really ma mail carriers will not be out delivering your mail for safety reasons. Yeah, great move there. And right now we have 900 eye alerts. And while a lot of schools and businesses canceled early yesterday, more cancellations are still coming in. Right. The bottom line is, if you don't have to be outside, don't. And we've been talking about how a lot of you knew yesterday. I think, you know, over the past 12 hours, our executive producer just told us we've gotten 400 more closings. Yes. Mm -hmm. More and more people are canceling their businesses, daycares. Mm -hmm. So make sure you're paying attention. If you do have something scheduled today, make sure it's still open. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And a lot of businesses, too. I'm seeing them cancel. Sure. You know, I mean, like it could even be an exercise class exercise. or something that like was that. A, I've, I've seen yeah. a lot of those. So, and, yeah. and while we're telling you not to go outside, we're not going outside either. Right. Michael Estime will join us in a minute from our mobile broadcast studio. But first, uh, how are we looking throughout? The day. So really, really dangerously cold, and you know we did make that decision. When we get to Michael, we'll talk more about that. But the bottom line being is that you know we hear from you all the time, and we take what you say seriously. It makes no sense to have our reporters standing outside on a dangerously cold morning, right? So thus the mobile broadcast studio, which you will see in just moments. Wind chill warnings are in place. They kicked in at one in the morning while you were hopefully getting some sleep. They go till four o'clock tomorrow afternoon. So we're in for a couple of really just dangerously cold days. Temperatures right now are around zero, if not a bit below or just a wee bit above. So we'll say from about four below in Mansfield to two above in Ravenna right now. It's four below in Chardon and it's breezy and those winds are gusty. So we're seeing those wind gusts anywhere from 25 to 30 miles an hour. And when you take that into account, this is what you get as far as wind chills right now. It feels like 30 below zero in Sandusky. It currently feels like 19 below downtown Cleveland, 17 below in Ashtabula, 18 below in Akron, 23 below in Worcester. Michael, we've been talking about it. We repeat it. This is nothing to kid around with. And I know you are dressed for being outside of the mobile unit at this moment. Yeah, Holly, good morning to you. It is chilly to say the very least. In fact, temperatures outside. We are right now at Voinovich Park in downtown Cleveland at about zero degrees. You factor in the winds out here and it feels like 18 to near 20 degrees below zero. You can see, of course, the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame in the background. And again, I'm here to let you know it is cold and it's so cold that you can see that it's completely ice covered here in downtown. The Good Time 3. You know, they're not doing much today. They're obviously locked in in the ice. And you can see our Jasmine Monroe is nice and warm in our mobile studio. But here's a really cool tidbit of information that I was. So in North Pole, Alaska, it is eight degrees Fahrenheit. That means that it is actually colder in Cleveland right now than it is in the North Pole. I think this is the first time that I would say. I wish I was in the North Pole right now. Jasmine, it is very chilly outside. Oh, I, now we all know how Santa Claus feels. Well, right now we are inside of this mobile newsroom, our mobile broadcast studio. And as you can see, we are trying to stay bundled up even inside of here. We have heaters right here. We have our hand warmers. I have about three layers on myself, boots, and you can still see my breath when I talk. And even frost on the windows, they're trying to keep up. So that's how you know how cold it is outside. So if you don't have to come outside, I would stay home, stay warm, get your hot chocolate and make sure you're warm but we